everyone, Terry Cruz here, and this is NHL 24 on EA Sports. Hey folks, welcome back to another matchup of this series of the NHL 24. This next matchup is about to take things on in a Metropolitan Division. We see the matchups here back in the regular season, as it turns out to be an upsetting run here for the New York Rangers to pick up over the Carolina Hurricanes for the last game of the season. But this time for the season, we are about to be seeing this rematch from the playoff edition to a regular season. It's the New York Rangers ready to face on against the other team of the Carolina Hurricanes. This matchup is going to be a tough run and you know it. By all it takes, it is a lot of tough hardness to get everything out. We noticed that the New York Rangers are a tough team. They're in first place right now, as we may not be knowing who is going to take over next. But this is the tough one that everyone really wants. As we're seeing the courtesy of these lineups right down here, as we start up for the New York Rangers, we have one of the biggest players here, Artemi Panarin. He has his first eye ability to take his own goals. His step away has been turning to be a one of the biggest and a better of the all. The third eye can make a perhaps passer right over to the open players in this offense. It turns out one of his biggest players in this offense. All it does turn out is a tough one than you think. Next is Adam Fox. He has a tape to tape early pass within the vision to go with the great zone abilities to have a deep look open firing for the puck and give it off to the open players to go with a huge setup, go deflection, or take another pass here from deep firing zone for the middle of the ice to the neutral zone. And right in there we have the starting goaltender, Igor Sisterkin. A butterfly effect with an early good settling saves, the last stand and a great one-on-one -on -one saves. Post to post and no timer taken. He has a lot of saving boost to go with the team energy to have the energizer and instinct with the great shot anticipation. And last but not least is Mika Zibanejad. He has his own ability it calls Magnetic. Now you know what Magnetic does. He does have it with the blade and he can try to take right from the puck to have this blade and go right from the stick. It's a better setup of this one to go with the Ely Pass reception and a puck pickup. It turns out to be a hard one to take in for Mika Zibanejad, but all it does turn out, one of the greatest. So your starting goaltender will be Igor Shesterkin, and now let's meet your, the other team of the Carolina Hurricanes. Now this is what we're going to call for now. Their team is always that good, but they're going to be finding it out who will take it from here. As we have a look, we have is we have is one of the biggest all star all star player. It all calls for Sebastian Aho. He has a great fur eyes too, just like our Timmy Panarin. But we have to find out what goes here. There might be another solution of how this is going to take over right from the other side. Next up is Andre Svechikov. Skilled up, it's a elite lacrosse moves. Now you can take with the puck and go right from your deflection in towards the net and with our puckling rebound to have that trick shot. It's a lot of great moves that you have to believe on him and how well he does and we will see him how well he does on ice. And finally it's Jacob Slavin, a shutdown defenseman run. His great run defensive set has been taking a great look of his offense appearance. But we will be seeing how well he does for his better offense to take a lover look. The starting goaltender is Frederick Anderson and Ante Ranta. As of right now, we have right at this moment, Ante Ranta will have to take his own starting lineup for the goaltender. Unfortunately for, for Frederick Anderson, he will be have to play up with the fine and up to the comment by Vera Kurchikov, and that will be the narrow player on the other side. And now let's get into PNC Arena. Standing by, I have a son of beast, and along with the other commentators of the crew, I have another one to take care of it from in between the range. On the other side, we all go for nickel, and the other the center ice we have is test tube, and that will be that. 
Let's get started. Beast all yours. Here we are in Carolina as we're about to see the Carolina Hurricanes facing against the New York Rangers in PNC Arena. Here we are folks, right now I'm going to be standing by along with Nickel. This is NHL on EA Sports. Let's get started. Here you got a delay penalty on the start call for the Carolina Hurricanes. That's right now they'll have the first power play to start up for the New York Rangers. The slashing is on Sebastian Naka. There's no way you can't just make that slashing call because this offense is going right towards it. The slide of it is not that easy at all. The first power play is coming on for the New York Rangers. They are the best team in the Eastern Conference in the Metropolitan Division. But this all turns out they're one of the biggest teams. This offense is turning out one of the biggest run on the set. And they have been playing here back in the last season of the game. And they make the shutout run right by the others. How does he really take here for that one there, Nickel? Well, they're always a good team. I know that Panera and their teams are trying to make that one connected. Well, when you're calling that one here for the offense, you've really got to sell things up. I like that when it's now how the score does turn out. It definitely can be way harder than that. Never seen how this one goes. You're going to get this one all over and down. They're going to love in this set, and this is how the playmaking comes in. This is what everybody does. They're going to need that one to make the pick, Chance. Here's the Gustafsson. It's on the outside. Now pass over again to Panarin. Panarin has his third eye ability, looking for his settle down run to take it all. Stahl clears out the puck in his Ranger zone. New York back in offense right now as Coyle will have it. Deep pass to Trocek. Takes a tumble down. That will be the first setup on a defensive set. His skills is just taken down. Wow. Coyle takes it over and we have a 4 on 4 going as a cross checking on Kreider. You're never going to like that call because that is going to change it over. This offense is not a great choice. This setup angling is going to take them bangle down. You see, that's what happens. You don't want that. The Hurricanes and the Rangers are on a 4-on-4 four -four power play zone, while the Rangers' Kim Heldy kill is already now on the board. The win puts up here for Mizika Zibanejad. He'll clear the puck zone, and now it's the Hurricanes' power play with only 140 left to remain. Puck clears out of the zone, and now he will have his own time to give it over. He goes right back over again to Panarin. Clears the puck out. The Hurricanes are back in the offense, now finding Carl Kennedy. Settles in, waits for the puck. Sketchy, now finding D'Angelo. D'Angelo finds the nose end. Truba takes the puck away from it. And we'll have to leave the puck out of here, and this one goes right to Anderson. Here's Bunting. He'll have the puck here in a neutral offense in the Ranger zone. Take from the puck! Miller takes it over with his puck steal. Now finds advantage at. Short game it on the way! Panera! Blue shot! Rebound and save made by Anderson. This is offensive shot. Oh man, you never seen when it was going to happen like that. Looks like his time miss penalty is almost up. Panera shot! Plugged away by Anderson. The power play is over as right now the full pressure is on the New York Rangers. Still going! Panarin shot! Take the rebound and put it away by Anderson! Savannah chat over to again, now back to Truba. Now goes over again to VC. Puck moving around for the Rangers territory to the home king zone. Savannah chat shot! Now a good save made by Anderson and now it goes back to Truba. Truba shot! Hit off the shoulder and goes back the other way as Orloff will have it. We've seen that Orloff has definitely played with the Bruins but his time is done. He's now with the Hurricane Zone to play with his team. I know this is a tough angle for him. Warlock is always the best player in this offense. He definitely helped him out with the, with the team of the range for the Boston Bruins. And it looks like 
this is going to happen too much. And I don't know what will this happen, because this is going to be a tough one and nobody has ever saw. Benito blocks a shot as uh, now is Ava with the puck. Hurricanes are in the transition. Benito takes the puck away. He gets off to Chuba. Moves quickly to VZ. Deep pass to Benito! And oh, make that one a huge save inbound. Anderson's going to hold it up with only 13.08 to go in the first period. Still got a lot of attacking, but this is a tough one to get. Players are set, ready to take the face off. It is a no score in this game, as right now it's a nothing score run in this, court, in this play. Lindgren takes over to Fox. Fox shot, and he scores! The first one goes in for the New York Rangers! It's awfully on a power shot, right to the corner of the crossbar, and it got one right in. It's a lot of great hustle offense. Adam Fox delivers it all, and this was a flip and a switch. Goes with a flame and right down towards there in this offensive run. Got deflection right here, hit the pad, and had that one in. Rangers on a great start with the 1 0 lead over the Hurricanes as they need to make the time go quick. Right now, the New York Rangers makes another win with the faceoff. Svechikov will have the puck in the settling zone, and this one takes over to Jarvis Shot. First stop comes in for the Igor Sisterkin with only 12 for 9 to go. Now both teams are set, ready to take the faceoff into the offensive zone. Trocek wins the faceoff. Lindgren on his way down, now finding again to Wheeler. Wheeler making his way in the corner. Fire a shot! Playing the way too soon as Anderson has to hold that puck up. This one's going to be a high fly in the muscle. Whenever you get the flame, you just make the power out of it. I mean, that's all it does. Jacob Slavin has a one of the ultimate of his shutdown ability. His ultimate ranging is a great on to make this offense look on the run. I'll try to keep an eye on him if he makes a shutdown right on the New York Rangers. Back to you guys. Here's Fox on his way down, finding a pass down to Coyle. Coyle pass can't make him work. Anderson will have to reach him out and will stop the play inbound with only 11.40 to go. Now the win comes in as Slavin gives it off to Fast. Just for Fast, they do a puck up across. The Rangers are back into the offensive zone. Deep pass to Wheeler. Toward the corner. Finding a throw check. Lost the puck and bounding as Martin and Nook takes it away. Here's Fast on his way down. Fire the shot. Blocked away here by, by Schnepp. Gustafsson right now finding again to Strider. Off to Zibanejad. Zibanejad can't make the move easy. Fast on his way to the corner. Now find Mario the glove save here by Yusha Sturke. Kako gives it over to Zibanejad. The new switch up for the New York Rangers now finding Schneider. Fires the puck around the net. Kreider goes back to Kako and moves it over. Give it back to Kreider. Can't make the connection to Zibanejad work. Kako finds Schneider. Fires away! That deflected off again on the goaltender that goes here back the other way. As right now, Schneider holds his team up alive. They're still trying to get over this. This motion of this momentum is not going to make them straight. But this is a lot of hard work in this offense. Goal to the way! Oh, he just did not have enough timing as the puck went sailing over right to the glove. Here's Panarin right towards the corner. Tejito. Schneider fires a shot. Hit off the powder by Anderson. And now finds Hito. Now the Schneider back in the offense. Fires away. That's another hit stop. Cotton is still on his way down. Panarin gives it off again to Schneider. He's on the back of the net looking for help. Tejito gives off the Cotton shot. Hit the pad save here by Anderson. And they're still going. Lindgren. Back now to Hito. Fires. Hit off the side of a the pad. There is good offense. This is a lot of courtesy for no help. 
This offense has already been changing a lot of ability. I just have to say, it's a lot of it, money thing to admit. Here's Fox. Fires away. Hit off to the two soon with the save made by Anderson. Fox gives off to Lindgren. Lindgren is way. Blocked it up by Anderson. Just about 6.45, they already been up here that time while the defenders got blocked and harried out of gas. Adam Fox has an ultimate take-to-take -take feed of his own. His ability is arranging to make the offense work to have it on the run. Snitchikov has an ultimate lacrosse cross trick move to have that one with the puck. When it goes up to the stick, he can take that one back with a deflection and put a rebound on the tricky move. This trick shot does have it all. I have an all-time ability to keep an eyes on the two from Adam Fox and for Snetchikov. I'll be keeping a wa eyes wide open on the two. Back to you, Spies. Garbage shot! Hit the stop by Snetchikov! Cries to Sturkin. He's already getting away with this one. This is a tough one. Garbage! So oh, Sturkin got a good save here with 5.34 to go. You don't want to make this one mess up. If you do it, that's how hard you're going to get. Trocek wins the faceoff. Now back over to Wheeler. Wheeler gets down. This is covered by Miller. The Hurricanes will have their chance here to pick up a run to go with another attack zone. Bunting stuck up in the corner. Took a big hit as Miller takes a rebound. Bunting will recover the puck here with just only 4.40 to go. 1-0 is a score for the New York Rangers. Got Kennedy right towards the corner. Lost the puck as Fox takes it over. Trojak! Oh, he went slammed down to the corner. Got a great stop. This offense gotten so much tricky. No way they can't do. They just did not want to make that one feel bad. At all costs. Fox back again to Benino, and now BZ fires away! That's stopped by D'Angelo with the puck, as right now it goes back the other way. Here they come on back in the offense zone. Finds body shot, gloved it up by Shesterkin. Lindgren keeps it away, and now it's Benino. Over to BZ. Stick handling his motion as it goes down. Burns finds down to Drury. Drury right in the corner. Fire shot! He scores! It's Nikes! A one-on-one -on -one attack! That put a tie in the game! Look at this offense! If you know this pass turns out that the Nikes gives it over, he just gotten great! This is a turnout to make a knockout like it's successful. This range motion turned out big. The Hurricanes are tied up with one as Brent Burns takes the assist. And this one goes back down the other way now into the offensive zone to pick up another run. Mika wins the faceoff as Schneider gives off to Kako with only 2.45 left. A great start with a comeback run in the first period. That's where the first start turns to be Adam Fox. But now that just has it, has it all to do it again. Knows it right towards the corner. Lost the puck as Kreider takes it over. Anderson will give it over now to Burns. Kreider trying to take a puck move, but it's Burns with the recovery. Drury on his way down. And it's taken over by Snyder. Now finds Kreider on his way down. And got a little bump out. Here's an old one. Oh, almost have been taken in to have that early lead for the first. This was a close call. They never seen what was going to happen like that. And I know they didn't. They just did not want to get away with it. We are down to our last minute remaining in the first period as Snetchikov gets wiped out. Passes back to Panarin. Gives off to Schneider. Looks inside. Edel didn't have the puck right away as it was been blocked out. Lafferdier right now finds Lindgren. Edel takes his way to the corner. Can't get him up, puck to move. Shachikov right into the center ice. Moving foot. That shot went denied. Goes right to Shachikov. Goes to Slavin's shot. Hit off the way by 
length to Sisterkin, and the time is up. Great play as a hustle run for the one-on-one, -on -one, picking up for Nekas. We'll be right back with the second period right after this break. One-on-one -on -one is the score. We'll see what happens. Who takes the lead in a second? Welcome back to the PNC Arena. We are about to sell in for the second period. And we're on our way, ready to start for the second one to take the face off. As we're saying here, this close game is a takeoff match in between the two. As right now the Hurricanes have a comeback, let's figure out what Nickel has to say. Well, there's one way that I'm going to say this. When this is the offense, but his head coach has been turning out and he's has been talking to one of the team's players. This offense got a really great start. But this offense was, however, pretty good Rangers on the other side. This was Adam Fox. He turned out that big. His offense has been going way ahead. The stronger it takes, the more encouragement he does. This is turning out in a very difficult strength. But this is not how it does. This offense really got a lot of the hard trouble to make a hack out of it. But not to worry. They're trying to get this one over and done. Right now, Anderson's going to hold it with just only 18.23 to go in a, in a second. Glad you have us back here with us as it's still a tie game. Now we're going to off win for the Hurricanes. As now they are at the pressure, D'Angelo finds Skidgy. In corner, battling for the loose puck of the chain. Can't get an open pass to go. Panarin takes the puck over. He whips it over to Zedel. Zedel back up again to Fox. Now gives it off to Lafreniere. Here's Zedel! Good shot! But it's stopped by Anderson with a huge stops motion save. The quick timing, the more release make, he's just going to get this one away with. The late penalty been called as Artemi Panarin is in the penalty box. They will get their first power play for their Carolina Hurricanes. As we all call for, here's Test Tube standing by for Igor Sisterkin. His butterfly effect is an ultimate way to make his strength ability. And here's the thing, guys. This was how tough it is. Igor Sisterkin is one of the biggest players in this offense. We might have to find him out how well he does with his offense and the power play to have it all down. I'll try to watch out for him if there's any case to go with a different chain. Back to you, guys. Kalkenemy with the puck on his way down towards the right wing. Takes a move, it's blocked by Trocek. Trocek clears the puck. Carolina back to the offense zone as Kalkenemy's pass has been broken up as D'Angelo recovers the puck, finding on his way down. Side puck move, recovered by D'Angelo. That takes it away hit. Truba carries the puck out of the zone. With 50 seconds in the remaining of the power play, still a tie game. Good throw had it over, but this time it won't be enough. Pass it over to Bernino. Gives off to Miller. Looks a good throw. Looking to get your hand in. Pass, Bernino! But can't stop by Anderson! What a great stop here for the goaltender! He's all amazed. His hand is all is going great. Faster than you think. That was a lot of hard work he credit. The main advantage is over for the Carolina Hurricanes as right now they're back to an even strength. A great stop by the New York Rangers. Yeah, this attackman has gotten great. I know I can definitely tell that one here because our Teddy Panarin. He's gotten great of the use of his skill. He had that tripping call earlier. That's not going to be enough to make that one maintain it. Special gut finds Nozin. Nozin on his way down, finding a back pass. I'll go shy. That gets dropped wide. Fox now over to get to Lafreniere. Lafreniere get bubbled up. Slavin finds Fetchikov. Now he gives over to Jarvis. Fox gives it over again to Lindgren. He moves over to Lafreniere. Now pass to Guido. Guido in the corner. Take the puck away from here as the Pasanapo recovers it. Now back to Slavin. Oh, and Kreider got that down. And they're doing it. They're getting a fight and they're going to have a putback. It's not offense. You don't mess this up. 
You can't make them feel like they're going to get over this. This offense, you can't get away with this. This is not going to happen well, and you're never going to get that timing done. And the punch is over. He goes down, as right now Chris Kreider just got him, knocked him out. But his man is coming up to get him. Yeah, I mean, very tough and honorable. The aggression of Jacob Slavin, he just wanted to shut him down. That is going to be a lot that hard to make the challenge go work. And Ray, right, those two, it's still a tie game. Chris Kreider seemed to be unhappy with Jacob Slavin. They both have a five minute penalty box kill. They're just getting away with that one. Yeah, seriously to say, you don't want this to happen. Because if you do, you're going to get out of here for your life. Snyder went down and the penalty's called on Carolina. Marvin has a charging call and now the Rangers are going to get it back on his offense. Yeah, it's seemingly like Jory Martin did. He just went and made a rough. He says, come here you. And then he was bumping him. That's the play you can't just mess him up on. Or Timmy Panarin as we have test tubes standing by. The third eye ability has an all in range. When he has his offense, he'll try to make him do anything in the power play position. His tough range is offensive and his control will try to keep him going. This is a hard one to maintain, guys. I'll watch on our Temi Panarin if he gets him with a good set of a pick to go on this offense. Back to you. Panarin into the right wing. Trying to move him back to the outside. And it's stopped by Anderson. Fox trying to deliver it. Our Terry Bonero wants to think about resetting the play. And no play cut here. Rangers lost the puck in control. As Shesterkin will give it off to Lafreniere. Back in his own. Trocek. On the one of move. Trocek did not see what was going to happen. Sketchy takes the blocking pass away. Sketchy fires the puck. Fox on his way down. Deep pass to Panarin. He looking for a run. Trojek lost the puck here again. No timing goal, make it perfect. This is tough. I don't know what to say about this, but this is a ranging offense that nobody has been picking up and gone. Here's our Timmy Panarin back in the inside, just down to 10. They are losing time, and it looks like Martin is getting back on ice. And the man advantage is over. Artemi Panarin doesn't unable to make it. He fails to go with the power play run. Yeah, it's a great thing that yeah, everyone has been going for. That the Hurricanes are on its pressure. This offense is not turning it great enough to make it straight. But however, they really are picking it up. That D is such a tremendous run that they are picking up for tonight. Panarin past the Fox now finds the better jet over now to Panarin. Panarin shot! Shit's blocked and it's Fox for the recover. Sibanej have only a minute and a minute and a half to play in the period. Midway period of the mark. Trojak now finds again to Sibanej. Smart! Skeji blocked! Panarin rebound has been blocked away by Skeji. Two time defender. Now back to the full pressure on the steam as Trojak trying to give off the Trojak. Here's Spot. Fires away! Innocent City! Hold on tight! With 9.14 left, he is still amazed by this guy. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've got to keep an eye on that. You don't want to make him feel like he's out of the zone. Now with the wing for Orlov. Now back to Chatfield. Fouling for the repuff. Orlov now fighting again to Drury. Drury now for Orlov. Knows it on his way down. Gives it back to Chatfield. In the attacking zone, Chatfield tries to look it over, but Panarin takes it away. Oh, we just made that one a tumble twister on a stop run. Wow, this is a lot of hit. The major credit, he just got in so much pressure. That's a tumbling takedown for the Hunkane power. Save me, Benino didn't have the deflection in as it stayed out of the net. Bonino now trying to switch it over. Now finds Fox. Fox shot! Stop the way by Anderson! Kako battling for the loose puck as Lindgren takes it over. 
Kako trying to live it up. Benino, back to Fox. Puck moving around the zone for the Rangers. They are still looking again. Lindgren, back to Benino. Benino, pass to Lindgren. Lindgren shot! It's deflected away on the goaltender. Hard shot, blocked up. Nice uh, defensive recovery. This is all the offense is not going to pick up the run. They are saying they just can't get away with that. So Sturkin's going to hold that puck with 6.16 to go. And the tough, tired defensive players and the offensive players are going to have to try to settle it up, rehydrate, and get back to work. The offense is ready to pick up its transition. It's still a tie game, looking for our next win, next uh, goal to take for the Rangers or Hurricanes. Here's Truba on his way down in his offense. Gives off to Goodrow. Goodrow in the corner. Lost the puck, doesn't know where he goes. Easy gives it off to Truba. Looks down to Miller. He now off the corner to Benino. Benino shot! Anderson got a good timing to have that stop save. 5.29 to go in the second period. And this one calls for Zabika Zabanachad. Test two. Now, as I know for sure that Mika Zibanejad has a lot of great magnetic ability, his motion of his offense is going to be a lot pick off the take. When he has that most of the time, he might have it all down here to make that connection work. From his puck playing bound to have that blades attachment. When his stick is bounding, he can get it right towards the puck. But this offense is a tough one for Mika to try to take him over. How it does happen, we'll have to see how well he does. Well, he do for his offense to pick up another run. I'll try to watch on him for Mika Zibanejad to keep it over with. Back to you. And he scores! Captain Jacob Trouba delivers 71 goals in his game. And a tie has been come and broken. You know when Jacob Trouba waits around him, he was going to try to find room. When he spins around, he's finding a good angle. He just got a look of it, his own target, and he found a right open right towards the bottom hand of the left. He just got bit. Rangers are back in front as Capo Caco has the assist. That's 23 for the Rangers for Capo Caco to keep the career up high. Now the win. Here's Slavin. He moves his way down. Tries to... Locked it up again as right now Igor Shosturki recovers a big save. Here's another one for Akako Kako. Finds the Benajad. Give a puck pass to Kako. That stopped on that by Burns. Teddy went down that hard. Brad Burns says, give me that puck. You never take mine. You never mess with defenders. Zyder pass to Kuhl. Looks over to Wheeler. Pass to Trochak. That shot went wide. That good deflection by Brett Burns. Well, you could say what's now. Because when it's when the stick was being lifted here on the on the offensive stick, he just really couldn't could get there. And he just made that one to try to deflect it. That's very hard. The teams are settled in in the gliders territory. As right now the range is picked up for a one. Now the win for Karkenemy. Burns finds Terrain and that slamming shot. Wow, Lafreniere with the block went down hard. Pretty quick and smooth. That's whatever happens. Lafreniere just got a great set. He just went down right towards his knees. That's a big save. Burns picks up back on Bon Bunting. Now we'll find Terrain. Terrain pass broken up. New York back to the offensive zone as Schneider will have it over. Now back to Gustafson. Gustafson to Benarin. In corner now, Gustafson. Looks to pass to Benarin. Trying to go with the backhand with the pass by Gustafson. Great look, but it's a clean defensive stage. Backhand. And deflected into the bounding as right now Anderson will hold up with 105 to go. We are almost done with the second period. They're trying to get this away quickly as they can. Yeah, they sure do. Guido wins the faceoff. Just one minute remaining in the second period. Fox tries it. 
Oh, that kind of almost got in the back, but that one slid around. Bonino finds Lindgren. He looks fine in the good row. We're going on the backhand, and Gunderson will blow it up to have it in for number pressure save. 29 seconds remaining in the second as they are trying to get back to work. This offense is killing them. Now with the win, here's the Angelo pass the fast. Moves it back over, and good throw back the other way. Flings around the puck, finds Benito. Benito, shot, stopped by Anderson. That close call range is picking over in the S inbound, but still a great stop. Yeah, and you know that save has been always been picking up there in center piece. It's all because of what Anderson does. He tried to make that quick move. His offense is going right towards him. That's a lot of help. And that will do for the second period. A great leadoff score for Truba as he got that one with an early lead to take a 2-1 run. We will get to the third period when we come back right after this break. It is great for you back here at ICE, and right now we are ready to finish it off with the final period. Well, we hope you enjoyed this game, but this is a lot of great matchups in a showdown between Carolina and New York. We've got a great matchups to have that one here, since you guys made a prediction, and we appreciate you to have it with us. And hopefully, this one is the best part that we have. With the win, here's Slavin. Good stop by Capococco. Fast break. It's one on one. Shot. Oh, Anderson got a piece of it. And he keeps it out. That's a tough when you just don't want to make him feel uncomfortable with that. Anderson just is looking over this place and said, I got it. This was hard for me to try to keep it up. Savannah Jett on his way down and he finds Capococco. Looks to Fox. Now finds he over his Lindgren. Double man defender, now find Kako. Open shot, hit off the deflection here by Burns. Fox now finds Lindgren. Looks now to Fox. Fox lost the puck as Kreider rebounds the puck. They are still making their way. On full pressure, Savannah Jazz. Shot, stopped away, Kreider. Anderson stopping a two puck save. This is a tough one for Anderson. He is still fighting for it. And you don't want to make that mess appearance of that. They're just going to make that one feel like they need a lot of help. This pressure needs to keep an eyes on it. They've won two seasons. One for Anaheim Ducks and one for the Ana Anaheim... Sorry, I don't, what was it going to be? Oh, right, because Detroit Red Wings had it all. They're on a tough inbound. And you can't get away with that one either. Caroline invites Calcetomy. And inbound D'Angelo! Stopped by Panarin with a block shot. D'Angelo! Panarin takes it over with the puck on the Rangers. Tries to make a move. Sketchy on his way back down towards the Canes territory to the Rangers territory. Taravainen coming in with the move, unable to make that motion. Panarin gives it back to Lafaniere. Looks to Panarin, and the stop comes up with a huge save here on Anderson. Miller on his way back down the outside, and now give it off to Guido. Kalkinami takes the puck lift. Sick lift, excuse me. Truba now finding Panarin. Panarin on his way down, and he went to take a bang hit. That hit off very hard. This is not how it does, and they really are starting to get away with that one. With no questions asked, they're just getting away with this one. A lot of big help. Schneider has it on. Pass back to Cooley. Cooley right now to Fax. He finds Martin. Martin got his way down, finding Sketchy. Goes right toward behind it. New York back into the offense zone. Cooley right over again in the left hand on corner. He finds Strocek. Trojek battling for loose puck. Snyder recovers it. Looks to Gustafson. Gustafson lost the puck as Stahl takes it over. Stahl slammed it, hitting it back down on the fist fight. 
Snyder on his way back to the offense zone. Pass to Benadrat, stepping down by Anderson. Just for fast on his way on, on down to the end though. In quarter now, lost the puck as Capococco takes it over. No penalty call on, on the Hurricanes as Svechikov takes it back. Stopped away! Apo goes it over and stopped by Sistokin. Oh, he's been doing good out there. He just really can't get away with it. We have a look. Sebastian Apo with the third eye. It's all it does happen now. When his third eye turns around, he has to compete right towards the Artemi Panera and he has it all down. They're just trying to make them feel like they're already able to take him over. This offense has to make him feel much more comfortable than he does. I'll try to see if, the, if Sebastian Agro's got in the pass to make the assist, and well, hopefully that play works. Back to you, guys. Sebastian Agro right toward the corner. Pass to Svechikov. Hit block. Rebound saved by H. Sturkin. Zibanejad gives it over now, tiring the puck around in the board. And will have to be tired out as they call an icing, which is only 12.06 to go. If you are looking for your next game, we have the next one battle as we see the Anaheim Ducks. And they are away in Philadelphia to face against the Flyers right on the other side of the team. As we may notice before, here, guys, we love the NBA and we hope you enjoy with the regular in-season tournament to have it all bring up to Vegas. Do you really like when this play comes to work for this offense and defense? You let us know by leaving the comment box here below and you can also make your NBA pickums as well. It's free for everyone. That's all it does turn out because this is a lot of faithfulness. This pressure can take anybody's game. And I know I love to bait that one on the betting. Shotfield now finds Fetchikov. That puck takes away. No penalty on New York. Fox moves it over. Kreider takes it around towards the net. Looks now over. Bunning takes the puck steal. Fox tries to keep it out. Orlov has it over right now into the Canes territory. Took a big hit. And that's going to be a charge call on Adam Fox. Not a good choice. This offense, you do not take him down at this point. He's got a little aggressive right now. And Kane's just say, yeah, we got to get rid of that one for good. That's a hard on the steam. The Hurricanes now have their power play advantage to tie this up with the game. It's only 2-1 looking for a next one to take a lie. Trocek wins the faceoff. It's good throw. Will pay will the pop the puck cleared out. There are Carolina, Carolina Hurricanes back in offensive zone with the power play running in motion. Miller has it now to Trocek. Carry it deep away. Staying the man on the offense. Kokenemi passes over to Nozen. Looks his way down. On a move. Hey, move. Taken away by a defender, another stop by Susterkin. They are still believing on him. That's a crazy wild save for him. On this night, that's a lot of worthy credit run. They are just trying to get out of here. That pass back to Goodrow. Now goes to Miller. Miller! Lost the puck in Neckis, will have it all. Knows him, finds a pass to Bunting. He looks for D'Angelo. D'Angelo on his way now. Miller takes it over. Trocek has it around. Right finding Goodrow. Taking big down hit. And now D'Angelo will have it back. Kalkinami will have the puck back. Looks like he's ready to get back on ice. And that will do for the power play. As right now it's only 8 and 3 left. Still got a one point lead advantage for the Rangers. But the Hurricanes are still need to find a way to get back down. Here's Argo right towards the corner. Finds Bunning. Shot stopped away by Shesterkin on a pad. Panera on his way down to Lindgren. All alone. Shot. Oh, <laughs> Anderson says not this time, Lindgren. Oh, man. He's totally not good. Got insane to make that one run. Who's the call? We have test tubes standing by.
Adam Fox, I really love his appreciation. He has it all down with his tape to tape feet, and he's been showing off like his per se. Everybody's been crowding it on for his fan favorite, right over me, Shachikov. They're just making a love out of him. His bear plays, his offense has turned out great. I'm hoping this will be the next one to keep the game going. Icing is whistled on the New York Rangers as right now with only 6.39 to go. We have that time for another face-off. Hago wins the face-off. That's it off with the block shot. Shot stop! Oh, Shesterkin got a hit with the big save. Just 6, 6, 26 to go. In the third period, they are still looking to stop their run. This energy has been blowing high mark out of it. They've never been feeling like they wanted to get away with it. Here's another win for the Hurricanes. It's the Angels on the outside looking over again. Lindgren with a huge stop. Now finds Panarin trying to take away. Hedl still has it. Over to York. Lindgren stopping the same by the block. Finds Lindgren. And they will have to signal a penalty call on the Carolina. That's a slash on Skitchy. He's in the penalty box. The power play is on for the New York Rangers. Uh-oh, not so good there. Because Brady Skitchy, he's getting bad out there. The Rangers are on its way for the power play for the second time, as right now with only 5.36 to go in the third. And with the win, here's Slavin. He will fire it out. Gustafson now gives it over to Quill. He gives off to Hedl. Hedl on his way down. Kako still has it all. He gives off to back to Kako. Nine times Gustafson. Gustafson! Not enough to take from here as this will blow it up by Anderson. Teams are set, ready for a new changeup on the offense. Still a 2-1 lead, looking to get their power play while it's still running. Turbine is still looking another way to get right towards his offense. Gustafsson, right now find Hedl. Quill, right now finding again to Lafreniere. Under five minutes remaining as the puck has been left up. Mark Stahl takes it over right into the, into the Ranger territory. With under one minute remaining in the power play. He passed the Hedo. Gets blocked out and Roloff gets it back. He coolly did not find Kako. He off to Kreider. Leads it off. Spin around. Pass shot. Who's made that one a huge stop. As Anderson got a big one to make the pass out of it. Who saps it right toward the outside, now gives it off, and bad pass broken up. Looks like he's ready to get back out there, and he's all set. Trojak hit down the deck! That big out of it! He scores! Chris Kreider! Another hit of the release man! He goes for it, and takes the two-point convention. If Chris Kreider has it, he makes a crease crasher in his own. He made that pass, but his early release man takes it over, and he blind that goalie right away. That's a take on take. It's easy to say right now, Chris Kreider has it all with the crease crasher and ability. Their points has been gaining up to a lot of percentage out there. They're just making him look clean, look fast, and fine. With the win, here's Sketchy, passes his fetch of off. Fighting the block over again as Lindgren gives off to Kako. And Zibanejad will have it out. Looks to Kako. Shoots! Blocked away by Kreider. Anderson holds on with 3.11 to go. The time remaining is not always an offense of it. But they are just getting off to a great start. They're trying to get this thing done. Now back the air away with only 3.11 to remain. In the third period, Hurricanes still need to get this thing down right. Petrikov with the puck, still three minutes remaining. Now he's in to the Ranger territory. Garbage shot. Hold up, save made by Sisterkin. Oh, he is too good. Just only 246 remaining in the third.
pulls the timing, and Lindgren will have his way down on the other side. Makes it deep. Sabanajad recovers the puck. Tries to make a quick move. Deep past the Fox. No penalty regained on Carolina. They've already been knocking it down on a delayed penalty call three times ahead. And the Rangers will have only has two. This was not the biggest day, but they're all sharing it ahead. And Aaron trying to give off the Lafayette. Hold up, trick shot, and it's stopped by Anderson. Jarvis on his way down. Toward the corner, need to look for her help. Looks it in. Jesterkin holds it up with just a minute and 25 to go. But the time is running down. That's why they don't want to make this one bad. They just really need to get this thing over with. That's all that does happen now to have it all. With the win, Lafreniere blocks a shot. Lafreniere weighs off with the icing as goes back over to Miller. Kuba back the other way. We're under one minute remaining in the third. And they are a tough team to be here. Terrible all alone. One on one. He scores. All in one cow motion. And he says, not done. Don't give up. That's what Terrible gets. He's all alone with his pressure. The move on take has gotten big. He blinds the goaltender that easily. When he gives it off to a quick motion, his setup is very of an all alone moment. And he knows this is how things are telling them the truth. They're just getting away with that. They need to find something quick. Just about 40 seconds remaining in the third period. They are still need to catch things up. And it looks like they're just going to have to leave it off. Love by Anderson. Just 26 seconds. After the full timeout remaining for the Carolina Hurricanes in the big setup, you're looking for a way to get a tie breaking before going to overtime. Bet this is not how it is. They need to see something else, what's going on. They might need to do something else about it. We'll see. And they will not pick it up from here. They still need to try and get something back, as Anderson will have that one saved up with only 12 seconds remaining. No time has been given right now as it leads off with only 3 2 run. Wind comes in. Terramainen. Down to 10 seconds. Bunning. Decide to give up the burns. And this is not going to happen now. It is over. And the Rangers take out the storm. This is the pressure to make. And you know what happens? The circuit just really got a great save out of it. And this is not an easy call. They are always the best team. They're in first place. They're trying to make that one feel good. Well, as of right now, with me, Son of Beast, along with Nickel and Test Tube, this has been a presentation of the NHL 24 on EA Sports. Thanks for joining with us and have a great night. All right, thank you so much. As we hit now, we have the three star players of the game. Adam Fox has a goal and four hits. All takes out with a big takedown with the penalty. Vincent Trocek is a second star with two assists and two hits. And your first star goes to Frederick Anderson. 47 saves in a row. A big night for him. Turn out clean. Then they have it all. Here's how you do with the total shot combinations in the team. 50 over 23 as the New York Rangers are battling along to take them over right from storm to storm. 48 over 38 for the Carolina Hurricanes, the big attackers. Time on attack was 1241 over 321. 79 percentage has gotten a little bit better at it, but 93 percentage for Carolina got a lot of strength. 28 over 14 faceoff wins got a great settling. If 11 minutes on a penalty kill, no power play goals, and 542 is a power play per minutes. Well, as I read right now, Terry Crews is out of here. I'd like to thank you all for watching. And if you're ready for this next game, we've got another one to come in. We've got the Anaheim Ducks and the Philadelphia Flyers. Back at Wells Fargo Center since Season 1 after the loss against the Islanders. Thanks for joining with us and we will see you next time. Peace out. For a while as the NHL 24 and EA Sports style. Okay, take care, folks, and good night in Carolina. If you don't, if you don't.
somebody will.